Hello everyone, welcome to my review show. So, gonna head to A&W because they have brought back the Whistle Dog. That's right, the Whistle Dog. Who remembers this hot dog that A&W sold uh, for many years? It's been off the menu, I believe, now for several years, um, five or so years. And um, I remember getting it uh, quite a few times many years ago, and I enjoyed it. But I hear that it's not as good as it used to be. Um, I believe it's a, it's still it's a hot dog split in half. The wiener split in half with cheese, bacon, and relish. And that's what I remember. So I'm going to go see if it is the same whistle dog as before. All right. Let's go check it out. A&W, whistle dog. Let's go. Hi, do you have the uh, whistle dog? Yes, we do. Can I just get that, please? One whistle dog? Yeah, that's everything. Sorry, thank you. Yep. All right, here we go, the whistle dog. Just getting that, I think it's, they've raised the price as well. Thank you. All right, got my whistle dog. Let's find a spot to eat it. Okay, who here remembers a whistle dog? At A&W. Let me know in the comments below if you've had it before or if you tried the new one and what you think. I've also heard that they now sell just a regular hot dog at A&W. But anyway, here we are, Whistle Dog. For some reason, there's the Toronto Blue Jays logo on it, even though we're in BC. But anyway, here it is. Looks like it's um, a different kind of bun. I don't remember looking like that. And it is definitely toasted. And yep, yeah, we got our uh, cheese relish. And that's about it. And bacon, obviously. Let's give it a shot. The whistle dog. Teeth just cut down. It's not split in half. It's just cut down the middle. There's not a whole lot of relish on here. Bun is a little bit over toasted. The bacon is pretty good. It's not bad. It's not bad. I think there's a different bun though than what I remember. Now I think this was almost eight dollars, seven something, seven fifty or seven eighty somewhere in there after taxes, uh, just for the dog, and that's a lot for what you get. I wouldn't buy this again uh, if it was in a combo, maybe with some onion rings, even fries. But uh, I would definitely go back to the burger if I went to A and W again. I remember it being a little bit better. It's not terrible, but uh, I'd probably give the Whistle Dog 6.5 out of 10. Might get a 7 if it was a little bit cheaper. Maybe $5 for a hot dog. Anyway, let me know in the comments below what you think of the Whistle Dog, if you've had it. And um, I think it's a limited time. I don't know if they're bringing it back uh, for good now or not. Uh, but, uh, yeah. I just wanted to try it because I used to eat it and uh, I used to like it. I don't know. Anyway, go to NW, probably getting a burger. Thanks for watching and uh, we'll check you out on the next review. Bye for now.